around the corner. Have you thought of where you want to spend your summer vacation? If not, today I'm going to introduce you a wonderful place which I think you can spend your summer vacation. Okay, um, this is my topic, a trip to Tainan. Let's get started. Okay, this is my outline. In today's presentation, I'm going to divide my topic into four parts. First of all, we'll be talking about the features of Tainan. And then we'll be talking about the yummy cuisines in Tainan. And then we'll be talking about the culture. And lastly, I'll make my conclusion. Attractions. Well, these are the three historical attractions in Tainan. Well, first is Anping Old Fort. It is built by the Duchess in 1634. And the Duchess used the Anping Old Fort as a place to look for the enemies. And secondly is the Confucian Temple. Well, this is the first place built in Tainan where students can learn knowledge and enhance new skills. And thirdly is the Shiken Tower. It is also built by the Duchess in 1655. And guess what? Luckily, these three attractions are very near. It only takes five minutes or less to walk from an uh, attraction to another. Okay. And then I'll be talking about the yeah, yummy cuisines in Tainan. Okay, first, stinky tofu, which is one of my favorite. Well, as you can see from the name, it's stinky, but it really tastes good. And then, beef soup. Well, it's also one of the most famous cuisines in Tainan. And then, tofu pudding. It is the most famous dessert in Anping. And uh, I I recommend this dessert to you because it is summer and this tofu pudding is ice and cold. And in Tainan, people all often add some pearls and red beans to it so that it makes it more tasty. And after, I'm going to talk about the culture. Well, in Tainan, people are very friendly. Well, if you have any problem about Tainan's culture, attractions, or cuisines, you can ask them, and they will be delighted to answer your question. And um, Thailand also have a slower pace and lower price than other major cities. So if you have a limited budget and you want a slow trip, you can pay a visit to Thailand. And lastly, I'll make my conclusion. Well, not not. Long ago, I have just introduced the historical architectures in Taiwan, in Tainan, which help us, which help us know what life is like in the past. And we also talk about three del delicious delicacies in Tainan, which you can taste, and the relaxing culture of Tainan. I hope that I, that I hope that these can help you learn more about Tainan. And I wish if you have time, you can pay attention, pay a visit to this wonderful city, Tainan. Thank you for listening.